There's your guys, butcher. Locker. And today I have a challenge lock. Um, it is Hellbound by TLP. Um, yeah, so I haven't really tried picking this one much. I tried, well, let's see who's come. Said hello. Hey, thank you, boy. Oh, okay. All right. Yes. So, um, haven't really tried picking it that much. I tried just a couple minutes, uh, just just now. Uh, got a nice false set, but nothing really else. So, hopefully, I can get into it. That'd be nice. Alright, uh, this is the bitting. Nice little high lows. It does. Uh, it does work. Damn it. It's a little sticky. Um, but yes, yeah, when I was trying to pick them up just before a little bit, it was, um, I think there's a lot of serrateds going on. Uh, let me get my thin picks out, me Peterson's 19 and 15 thousandths, and maybe a SS dev. Alright, top of the keyway. Let's go start with SS Dev. Got a counter in the back. Am I getting warding? I think I'm picking warding. Let's go to thinner picks. Uh, we'll pick on three. Click on two. Doing pretty light tension. I can't pick from the bottom. All right, nice bit of core movement when I Touched one and three now, that was two, just a little bit bigger, uh, more pulse sets. Uh, just going in, seeing one feels good, two, counter, uh, three. I dropped something. <laughs> That's three again. All right, nice deep pull set. One. All right. Can't quite get up and under. Four. Right, drop the whole heap. A little bit of false setback. Warding on this is quite difficult. It's very sharp, like 90 degree turns. Alright, got my 
pulp set back. Try one again. All right, one is good. That's two. Deep pulse in. Right, the front feels nice and set. Right, that's the back. Drop something. All right, nice deep pulse it again. That was one again. Before set. Right, a little bit deeper. me just dropping my lights I'm trying to look for a on the keyway tensioner so I can check what's going on front um, there we go boom all right that was number three I am very happy with that Alrighty. Alright, just need some. Alright, we can lock him back up. Let's get the music going, shall we?
bit of a gutting disaster. My um, shim got snagged up on something. All right, so these pins are absolutely amazing. Um, zoom out a little bit. Um, okay, so yeah, these are all just magnificent. All right, so number one looks like just a couple uh, serration sort of things, spooly serrations. Um, pin number two is a pin and pin. Just marvelous. Uh, pin number three is sort of like a torpedo pin with a really nice deep uh, sort of serration. Number four is awesome. Number four looks, man, I don't know what you'd call that. That's just uh, absolutely beautiful. Uh, number five is lots of nice, really sharp serrations and then a spool element. Right, number six is real deep serrations. Alright, driver pin number one is an incredibly thin-lipped deep spool. Just lovely. Yep. Number two is again really deep sharp serrations. Number three is a reduced uh, like reduced diameter that tapers up into just craziness. That one looks awesome. Number four is um, sort of similar. Uh, reduced diameter sort of thing and then it tapers up. Number five is a um, sort of a pin and pin one. It's got like a little eternal bit that moves and really deep sharp serrations. Number six is just a, like a real deep a uh, single spool element with a bit of a uh, tapering. Um, the core has got serrated. Uh, it is threaded in every chamber, and the springs got um, uh, four the same and two the same. One and two, and then three, two, six. Oh, in number one, there is a pin inside the spring. Huh, not seen that before. That's pretty cool. Hmm, very cool. All right, yes, so that was... Hellbound by uh, TLP. Uh, is that Thumper? I think that might be Thumper. Thumper lockpicking? Thumper. If this is you, let me know, mate. Um, yeah. It's got beautiful pins, so I think it may very well be. Alright. That one is going to be all for tonight. Until next time, stay well, stay safe, stay sane. Peru.